Okay, so this right here is my backpack. It has every single thing that I could possibly need to go out of the country for two months or two years. So yeah, really all you need is a 40 liter backpack and th that is what I'm carrying right now is the Osprey Farpoint 40 and I'm going to show you all every single thing that I have in my bag and everything that you need to survive on an out of country trip. And just so you all know, I also have a fanny pack. So what I carry in this is my, I'll put my passport. Here's my passport holder. Keep that in my backpack usually or at the hostel. But I do carry my camera, my foldable wallet, well, not foldable wallet, but, and then my cell phone. So that's what I keep in my fanny pack, because it's easy access and don't have to get my bag for, for all of that. Now let's check out what's inside of my bag. All right, so first I have a spork on the outside and a little mini travel kit. I can put this in this pocket. Then I also have a rain cover just in case it rains, you want your, your stuff to stay dry. In this pocket, I have locks. So that way you can keep your backpack locked up. You just put these through these rings and it, it locks your bag up. That way nobody can get in there. Eye mask so uh, you can fall asleep on the plane. I have a first aid kit. Earplugs. That way you can fall asleep easier. Then I have this for whenever you're walking around in the cities or riding a motorbike. And whenever I was in Southeast Asia, I, I really needed that for uh, riding around. In this pocket, I have a a journal. You'll need that for writing down addresses or just uh, talking to yourself about your experience. Uh, I know I really love journaling. And this right here is a, a battery pack which keeps everything charged. Now I'm not gonna lie to y'all, I, uh, I have affiliate links. So every single one of these products there is a link in the description. That way you can find it. But yeah, it, it helps supports me as well if uh, if you were to buy these products. And well, I'm mostly just wanting to, I want to make sure that you guys are prepared. So right here, is a electronics organizer. So this has just pockets that you can put earphones, chargers for your phone, for your camera. It, it keeps everything organized. And this is where you can put medicines or whatever that you want to bring that's liquid but you have to make sure that it's three ounces or less because if it's anything more than that they don't allow it through uh, TSA. This is a poncho for whenever it rains. Just a little bag for carrying fruits or whatever I might need to carry around if you're going shopping. Rain cover for my day pack that I'm about to show you. And then 
we have the Osprey Daylight Plus Day Pack. Now, you're probably wondering why do you need a day pack? Well, day packs are, it, it's a must because you don't wanna be carrying every single possible thing that you own around with you everywhere that you're going. And this is a way that you can just leave this at your hostel and then you can put just whatever you need for the day here in your day bag. This is to uh, protect you from the sun. Uh, I know I like going to Indonesia and Southeast Asia and it, it gets, there's a lot of sun there. Well, I guess there's a lot of sun everywhere, but it gets hot there. And then there's a travel pillow really nice to have on the plane GoPro chest mount GoPro wrist thing you guys might not need this if uh, you don't have a GoPro this is a, a boss speaker that is waterproof Sounds awesome, and it's just a, a speaker, just in case you like listening to music. I know I like to have music whenever I'm traveling. Foldable, foldable, lightweight jacket to keep you warm whenever you get cold. Rain jacket, keep you dry whenever it rains. Now this is something you absolutely need. Um, and it's a universal travel adapter. A universal travel adapter just helps you be able to like plug in your things and charge whatever you need to charge or then this right here is a microfiber towel I think that's what it's called but what it is is it's a towel that's made out of material that is quick drying and uh, yeah a lot of hostels don't provide you with towels so it's it's really nice to have your own towel This is a uh, flashlight slash headlamp that is uh, doesn't take batteries, but you just charge it. So that's pretty nice. Uh, charging wires for my laptop. This is my toiletry bag, which has tweezers, uh, fingernail clippers, uh, foldable toothbrush. These are really cool. They pack down really, really small. Then Tom's uh, anti-fluoride toothpaste. You definitely don't want fluoride in your toothpaste. In case any of you don't know, fluoride is in a lot of toothpaste, and it's a uh, it's considered a neurotoxin. You don't you don't want that. Travel comb. If you got long hair like me, you definitely need one of those. Uh, laundry bag, soap, and soap holder, and then Dr. Bronner's 18 and 1 hemp and lavender. This is stuff you can use as body wash, shampoo, shaving, uh, wash your hands, wash your clothes. It does everything. And then we got pa a packing cube. Packing cubes are really awesome because they keep everything organized. And in here I have like four pairs of underwear and uh, you want, this is really key. You wanna make sure that it's ex officio underwear or uh, there's, David Tolley has some that are like cheaper that are on Amazon. But, but yeah. This underwear is made out of like quick drying material. That way it, it needs wash less and it's quick drying. That way you can just wash your clothes in the sink. And then uh, I have like uh, two short sleeve shirts, two long sleeve shirts. I guess I have three short sleeve shirts. Two pairs of pants, two pairs of shorts, a pair of swimming shorts, and then uh, Socks will also go in here as well. And yeah, that's 
all the clothes that I will be bringing. Then, uh, I also have sandals. Be wearing these mostly, and then I have the shoes that I'll be wearing. Then, my laptop, and then laptop cover that keeps it protected and safe. Another thing are can uh, carabiners. Carabiners are really nice. You'll want a lock to put on your hostel to the door of your hostel or just on your locker or whatever you may have. A lot of places don't provide locks but uh, it definitely helps to have your own. And then uh, I also have like a mini little bike chain. That way uh, if I'm sleeping at the airport or wherever I'm at, I can just tie my bag around a pole. That way no one can steal my bag. So yeah, that's all of my things. I hope that you'll... Oh my. I hope that you guys are prepared now for your out-of-country adventure or wherever you're going. So really, it's it, 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 it's easy because you just need a backpack. You don't need to have a, a bunch of things with you. You really just need a 40-liter backpack. And all of those things that I showed you, you'll be able to survive for however long you want to be gone for. And yeah. On my last out of country trip, that's everything that I brought and everything was smooth sailing. And yeah, I'm going to be leaving the country again in, uh, in like six weeks or something like that. And yeah, that's everything that I'm going to be bringing. But yeah, I, I hope that you guys uh, enjoyed the video and are, are prepared and got something from it. And yeah. I, I've seen a lot of other videos and yeah I've done I've, I've done quite a bit of research to, to figure out what I need and what I don't need and yeah it would help me out a lot if you guys would check out the products or if you guys need them and buy them because I don't have all the money in the world but if you if you buy some of these things that you possibly need using my links then it, it helps support helps support me and helps me keep doing what I'm doing and yeah, I, but even if you don't, I just want you all to be prepared. I, I appreciate you guys and appreciate that you're watching this video. I hope that you all have a great rest of your day or night, depending on whenever you're watching this. And yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And if you want to see more content, make sure to subscribe. I would really love your support. Much love. Peace.